The big news from this week, because of COVID-19, the 2020 Olympic Games in Tokyo were officially postponed and pushed back to next summer, something that a number of athletes really saw coming. We spoke to Grant Holloway from Grassfield High School in Chesapeake, world champion in the 110-meter hurdle, who was hoping to make his Olympic debut. Today, I caught up with Francina McCrory from Bethel High School in Hampton, also Hampton University grad. She's run in the last two Olympics and each time earned gold in the 4x400 relay. She's also got two world championships to her name in the same event. McCrory was busy getting ready for Tokyo until she received the news. Of course, I was devastated. Um, I knew it was going to happen um, eventually. You know, they were canceling all the other major sports as well. Um, I was sad. I'm, 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 I'm going to be honest. I was sad, but I think it's, it was, it's for the best. You know, with the state of the world right now, I think safety of the human race is more important than the Olympics. Now, on one hand, she's trying to train and stay in shape for when the sports world does resume, but that's the problem. Pretty much every facility and every track is closed. So she's been busy doing a lot of what she calls neighborhood training. And it's not just for the Olympics. For Francina and other athletes, especially track and field, no events means no paycheck. It essentially puts us out of a job as well. You know, we, um, when we run, we get paid. So if they cancel all of the track meets, and most of our track meets are over in Europe, obviously, if we can't run, we can't make any money. So, but, um, you know, that's just another stressor. So I don't focus on that. I just focus on staying in shape and being ready when it's time to be ready. And we'll have much more on Francina and how she's getting ready this week right here on the Sports